Hello my loves and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how to get shiny silky hair in two hours. Yep, I discovered an incredible hair mask that I've been doing over the last couple weeks and I wanted to share it with you guys. It's a DIY hair mask that only involves three ingredients. This hair mask is amazing for those of you who suffer from dry frizzy hair like I do. It's amazing for the scalp. It's amazing for the hair overall. It's super easy to make. And best of all, if you have any leftovers, you can slather it all over your face and it acts as an amazing face mask. So it's kind of a two in one, but because this is a hair channel, we're gonna focus on the hair. So I'm gonna insert a clip right now of what my hair looked like before this treatment. As you can see, my hair is kind of dry. It's smooth, but it could be smoother. This is also a great hair mask for those of you suffering from dandruff or an itchy scalp or dry scalp or flakes and stuff like that because it's gonna help neutralize the pH balance on your scalp, keep your scalp nourished and moisturized and all the good stuff so that you will have a lot less flakes after the treatment. So to create this delicious hair mask, I like to call it a hair smoothie, all you're going to need is one to two bananas depending on how long and thick your hair is. I like to use two because like I said, I like to make a little bit extra so that I can put whatever is left over on my face. And then to that, I like to add in two tablespoons of raw honey. And then to that, I added in about two tablespoons of organic extra virgin olive oil. And then I just blended everything together in my Vitamix blender until the consistency was nice and smooth. The smoother the consistency is, the better. You don't want to leave it in for too long, no longer than one to two minutes because otherwise the mixture will heat up and it's not going to be the same. It's not going to be as effective. Once you have your mixture, you want to transfer it over to a bowl or container or something that's very easy for you to access and just apply it to your hair. I saturated my hair from root to tip and made sure that every single strand was very, very well coated. I do recommend brushing your hair out before you do this, especially if your hair is curly. That way you can minimize any tangles and you can really get in there and saturate your hair as much as possible. So the reason why this DIY hair mask works so well is because bananas are super rich in potassium, different vitamins and minerals, and natural oils and carbohydrates, which helps in softening the hair and also increases the hair's natural elasticity, which prevents breakage and split ends. It makes your hair super shiny, increases hair growth, and helps control dandruff. And like I already mentioned, it's great for treating dry, itchy, flaky scalps by keeping your scalp and hair healthy and hydrated. There are so many amazing benefits to using raw honey on your hair and your skin as well. Honey is an emollient, which means that it seals or locks in moisture into your hair, keeping it conditioned and reducing breakage and increasing the overall elasticity of your hair, just like bananas do. So if your hair is breaking less, it's also going to be growing much faster. Raw honey is also chock full of antioxidants. This helps prevent oxidative damage, which keeps your scalp and hair healthy. Honey also cleans the hair follicles by getting rid of impurities which minimizes clogging as this is often one of the main causes of hair fallout. I recently discovered that my hair loves extra virgin olive oil or EVOO. It literally sucks it up and it becomes so nice and healthy and shiny afterwards. I think my hair likes it more than coconut oil, believe it or not. So I've been trying to incorporate extra virgin olive oil into my hair care routine more frequently. So I would recommend that to you guys to try it out for those of you who have thicker, more porous hair like I do, try swapping coconut oil for extra virgin olive oil and see if it makes a difference for you. So the reason why I love extra virgin olive oil is because it's rich in many different antioxidants, mainly vitamin E. Vitamin E is an amazing moisturizer that moisturizes the hair. It also fights hair loss. EVOO also makes hair stronger and less vulnerable to breakage by increasing hair's elasticity and ability to retain moisture. 
Then all I did was threw my hair up into a top knot and I kind of secured it with a clip and left it in there for about two hours or so. I left it in for a little bit longer than two hours because you know how it is. Sometimes you lose track of time and it's a little bit longer, but it's not a big deal. The reason why I say leave it in for about two hours is because bananas have a natural lightening agent in it and so does the raw honey. Raw honey is a natural hydrogen peroxide, so it will lighten your hair a little bit and the longer you leave it in your hair, the lighter your hair is going to get. Now, my hair color got a little bit lighter. It actually does a lot of good for my hair because my natural hair pulls a lot of reddish undertones so my hair becomes brassy real quick so this is an amazing treatment for me because it tones down the brassiness it makes everything a lot more golden and ashier tone and i really really love that so i leave it in for about two hours after the two hours are up i hop into the shower and i wash the hair mask out of my hair as much as i possibly can with lukewarm water then i double wash my hair so i apply shampoo to my scalp make sure that I get all of that stuff out of my scalp, then rinse it out and then wash my hair with shampoo again. And then I apply a deep conditioner to the mids and ends of my hair and I leave it in for about five minutes or so while I do all of that other good stuff that I do in the shower, such as shaving, using body wash. If you're a girl, you know what I'm talking about. So I do all of that. And once I'm done with my little shower routine, I rinse all of the shampoo and conditioner out of my hair and then I'm good to go. So now what I usually do is just wring out my hair from any extra water and I allow my hair to air dry completely. And usually within about 24 hours or so, my hair is pretty much completely dry. And then I style it as a normal would so my hair styling routine is exactly the same nothing has changed other than I apply this DIY hair mask to my hair about two hours before washing it so as you'll be able to see in this clip after I style my hair my hair looks so much shinier so much silkier it felt so much softer and healthier I am absolutely obsessed with this DIY hair mask and I would highly highly recommend those of you who have dry itchy scalps or frizzy hair in general to try it out. So that is my amazing magical DIY hair mask on getting your hair shinier and silkier within two hours. I really hope that you guys try it out and love it as much as I do. It has literally made such a huge difference in the health of my hair and I am so excited to be sharing it with you guys. So if you guys love this video and want to see more of them, please be sure to give this video a big thumbs up and leave me a comment down below to let me know. And before I go, I quickly want to mention if you guys are loving my makeup look this makeup look is going to be on my second channel tomorrow this entire makeup look was created using products that are only ten dollars or under so it is a very affordable makeup look if you guys are interested in finding out how i created this makeup look be sure to be subscribed to the nikki sky youtube channel i will link it up in the cards above my head and also there's always a direct link to my second channel in the description box below. I want to thank you guys so much for watching and hanging out with me and I will see you in my next one.